Hi everyone, head coach Peter Fuller here with Chattanooga Football Club. You're about to watch with me, New Amsterdam versus CFC. Without further ado, let's go. All right, so this is our regular season game at New Amsterdam versus New Amsterdam here at home at, uh, at Finley. This game went from being canceled uh, due to some of the social injustice uh, situations that were going on in our country. Um, then we replayed it a couple of weeks later, um, and it happened to come right after the, the Cosmos game. Obviously, we went into the Cosmos game hoping to win, hoping to increase our standing within the division. Um, we had never beaten Cosmos, obviously, uh, we all know uh, from the, one of the, the earlier episodes that I did, uh, um, we, uh, we, we were able to get our first win as an as a organization uh, in that game against Cosmos, and it set this up. This now becomes a game where we're playing with the opportunity to go to uh, um, uh, to go in as a as the number one seed to win the East. Um, so guys are jacked. This is a goal that Zeka's just scored. Um, really good interplay in terms of uh, getting the ball forward, um, similar to a lot of the way that we attacked throughout the year. And uh, um, so it was a. Uh, really really good goal quick strike getting in behind them and conversely here you've just seen them getting in behind us they actually had definitely had some talent particularly from the midfield through to the front they were very talented and uh, and they caused us problems um, uh, and, and especially in the in the first half when it was still a game um, and you'll see, you'll see some sequences here. Uh, they, um, it was not an easy game for us. Um, little unlucky on that one. And again, I always talk on corners about quality and timing of the service and quality and timing of the running and those two being in sync with each other. And what you see right there is great service, really good movement but not quite in sync. So the ball that Darwin goes to head, it just ends up, he ends up just a little bit underneath it. Watch this now. What a good save right here by Red. Magnificent. And uh, you know, it was a big moment in the game. You know, it's one nothing right now. We're in the 26th minute. Um, they score, all of a sudden they gain some life and some belief. And goalkeepers can do that for you. It's, it's not necessarily just the quali quality of the save, but it's the timing of it. Um, the time in the game, the situation in the game, all of that. Um, and uh, um, he did it ever so well right there. Another really good early cross. Sean Russell does just, does just enough to put him off right there and we end up um, in a... a, a he is touches a little long and Red gets out and he's quick onto it and, and wins it back. But again, this is a, a stretch here now. They've had us under it a little bit. And as we do so often, when we get under some pressure, when we, we begin to have the game uh, begin to roll away from us just a little bit, we get direct in our attack, try and get it forward as quickly as possible, and Richard's just done it there, and we end up with a great chance. Uh, goalkeeper makes a super save right there. Here's some good movement through the middle third of the field. Again, Ryan gets caught on the ball um, and, and ends up nothing really comes from it. Um, another corner, we go back post with it. Great ball played back across by, I think it's Sean Hofstetter there, and a little bit unlucky not to, not to finish. Good job by Ryan right there to kill the play. As they're trying to break off of the off of the uh, corner. Really good stuff here from Juan. Oh, what a ball! What a ball! Darwin's touch is just a little bit long. Lets him down there just a little bit. It's a shame too because 
That pass was just absolutely magnificent by, by Juan Hernandez. Um, tremendous ball that he's just played. Um, game back possession there a little bit. Um, kind of a missed tackle in the middle third. It gets them going. This kid out on the right side had had a very, very good half. That wasn't his best moment, obviously. A, a very poor cross, but uh, um, when they turned us over in the middle third, as oftentimes happens, no matter who your opponent is, many times you're, you're caught out because you're trying to get, get some depth and get some width. And uh, here we are now into the second half. Another good goal from Zeka. Really, really well done. Um, beautiful ball into him from Warren. Just uh, tremendous. And again, I, I'm sure it's no surprise to you. Got many of you have been watching Juan a lot longer than I have, but. I, I think he, I think he, during the Nisa portion of the season, he played some of the best soccer, certainly that I remember, um, the, the best soccer I've ever seen him play. And I'm going to bet, probably in terms of his career, he was magnificent for us. Um, passing, defending, decision making, um, really, really good. Decided to try and press, nothing on there, and we, we pull it off. Here, Darwin does well, just, you know, a little bit unlucky. Um, not sure what happened, probably a stray arms caught him and, and he's down. Obviously the referee didn't see much in it, so, um, but uh, now the guy's complaining to the referee, you know, he fouled me, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Well, you got up awfully quickly there, my friend, so I have my doubts. Very unlucky for Sean Hofstetter right there. Um, Hoff, as I, I've said in some of the other episodes, I believe, might be the unluckiest man in America. So, uh, um, injuries, sickness, all kinds of different things this year. But... Uh, once he um, once he got going, I mean he uh, he, had, he he really got going. Here's a good goal right there, and I'm so happy to see him get rewarded. Great ball, great ball back across to from Nick Spielman again. Look at the service, look at the movement, and and the timing of everything is just right. Um, so it, it is very very good, and. I was so happy for Hoff. He does he does so much dirty work for us, so many little things, and uh, it was so nice to see him get rewarded. Great stuff, guys. That was really good. Really good move. Um, and again, uh, good to see Brian Bement back out there. Again, another guy that's just had some run into some really bad luck during the uh, terms of injuries um, nice during the NISA portion of the season. But uh, definitely um, a quality guy, quality player for us, really is. Holds the ball up well. And that's one of the things he does really, really well. End up in a good place. Clay Adams is hoping to uh, with his right foot, replicate what he did against uh, what he did did against Cosmos, and uh, just got under it just a little bit. Um, but again, a good sequence for us in the attacking third in terms of ball ball movement and in terms of player movement. And there it is, three nothing result for uh, Chattanooga FC versus uh, New Amsterdam, and. Uh, we are the champions of the Eastern, uh, Eastern Division, so uh, uh, wonderful. Uh, that was a wonderful night for all of us. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. I look forward to seeing you next time.